And we're back for another episode. In this episode, we're going to be carrying on until dawn. And as always, hello from me. Hi. We're still in the dork to... The dork. We're still a dork, and we're also sitting in the dark to try and increase the scariness effect. It hasn't worked so far, but we will see. And if you have any comments or any suggestions how I can improve this Let's Play, then please let me know in the comments down below. So, anyway, we've now been introduced to Josh... Uh, at an awkward moment, given he's got a half-open eye. So it says, Hannah and best brother, thoughtful, loving, and complex. So let's continue. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you going to install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. you got a spare million lying around, and I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, I think I left it in my other jacket. Oops. Hey, guys. Get up here okay? Yeah. Well, more or less, but it is so good to see you. What's up with him? Dun dun dun. Yo, yo, yo. We get things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. Okay. So Matt and Emily are a thing now, right? Yeah, so it seems. I mean, what's Mike think of that? I have a feeling Mike's already got his hands full, you know what I mean? Huh. Damn it. It's a freaking thing. It's iced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in. They're just all locked. There's gotta be, like, a window around the corner we can get, like, get open or something. Wait a second. Are you saying we should break in? <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey, not if I don't report you. Um... Lead the way, coaches. Are they flirting? Hey, Ash. Hi, Chris. Okay. Nice being back. So, how are you doing? Mm, good, but a little cold. I think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Yeah, that does sound pretty nice. That's his version of confident. If it was me, I would go walk straight up to her and say, Hey, lady, that's a nice hat, but I would prefer it if you were naked. Okay, moving on. Break into the house, shall we? I'm walking in zigzags. Who? Right? I'm walking in zigzags because I can. Like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? I just want to rip that Parker right off of her and make some snow angels, right? Uh, absolutely. When are you going to take her to the bone zone? <laughs> like, that could ever happen. Come on, man. She practically spends her entire life with you as it is. Well, yeah, but we're like friends. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley alone at last. You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. Maybe you're right. You're a hunter, bro. No fear, no mercy. I mean, she won't even know what hit her. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, I got it. Jeez. Okay. Let's keep going, shall we? So, how are we planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud? I didn't say I had a plan. You sounded like you had a plan. You better deliver, Cochise, or else you got four lovely ladies who are going to be freezing their buns off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. Oh, shoot. Nobody likes cool buns. Okay. Let's inspect this thingy right here. Which I think I can inspect the axe. Inspect the axe. Hmm. Okay, clue found. Axe holder. Anyway, next. Damn, I'm getting pretty low in juice here. I just had to turn off my GPS. Well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one.
Okay, so we climb again. in climbing class you mean Jim yeah you know with the climbing up the rope Whoa. Dun, dun, dun. did I do that I, I don't think so here use this okay whoa Chris I just got an awesome idea yeah totally what, what is it okay so I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's a, how's a stick of deodorant going to help? Spray on. It's a can. Oh, yeah. Now I got gotcha. you. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the little army dudes. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye-bye frozen lock. Bingo. All right, so you got this. I'm gonna go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. Godspeed, Pilgrim. Thanks for helping, bitch. Let's keep going. I'm not scared of nothing. I'm just gonna go prancing through in the dark. That's cool. Okay. Blue found family portrait. Dun dun dun. So we're walking through a dark house and the lights are off. And the door closed for no reason. Probably the breeze from the window because we opened the window. I'm not scared. La 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 la. I'm walking into a wall. Damn it. Okay, here they are. Hi, Chris. Very funny. Oh, how'd you know it was me? Shouldn't you be, like, getting the lock open or something? On it. Okay. So we have to find the upstairs. Here, upstairs. Where are you, boy? Okay, there's a the staircase. Yeah. Open window, eh? Can we close the open window? We can't open the closed window. We can't open the closed window. Oh, damn it! Okay. Are we going the right way? Here we go. Yep. Get the fuck. I've done this before in case you were wondering why I'm immune to fear. I, I knew that was going to happen. Perfect. Now I can smell good when I die. We're freezing our buns off out here. I bet you have nice buns. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll, I'll be here all week. Okay. <laughs> ah, crap, that thing freaked me out. What was it? Are you okay? It was like a bear or a tiger or something. Oh, it was just a cute little baby Wolverine. Baby? Don't worry, buddy. Soon. So which one of you ladies wants it first? Home, sweet, That's in the home. cup of tea. Sweet is not the word I use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire to go. This place barely looks any different. Yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? N not a lot of action up here lately. What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Make yourself at home, bro. We'll do. Yeah. Come on in. 
Take a load off. Have whatever you want. You just take whatever you want anyway, right? Whoa. Easy there, cowboy. What the hell were you doing with M out on the trail? What? I saw you and M. At the telescope. Before? We just ran into each other. It's been a while, so we hugged and I said hello. Is that against the law? Um, right. Right, I'm sure it's all it was. You know what? You can think whatever you want. It's a free country. Watch yourself, Mike. There we go. He's, he maybe dropped one ball. No one wants in on your territory, honey. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me? Was your sluttiness too loud? Sounds like someone's bitter she didn't make the cut. Yeah, it's all a big cattle call with that dream boat. Congrats, you're top cow. Cuts real deep calling this homecoming a cow. Hey, you're making everyone uncomfortable, Jess. Jealous much? Emily too frigid for you too. Hey, that's, that's uncalled, look. Whatever. I don't give a crap what you think. At least I can think. 4.0, bitch, honor roll. Suck on that when you're trying to sleep your way into a job. Who needs grades when you've got all the natural advantages you can handle? Oh, please. You couldn't buy a moldy loaf of bread with your skanky ass. <laughs> Are you serious? You think that's insulting? That bitch is on crack or something. Jessica, you need to shut your mouth, okay? No. You're the one who needs to keep your nose out of other people's business. I'm about to get right up in your business, you bitch. Are we about to get real? Because I am Can't down fight. to get real. Stop it! This is not why we came up here. This is not helping. It's not what I wanted. If we can't get along for ten minutes, and maybe we need a little bit of a break, right? Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, all right. Want to go do that? Any place without that whore. It's right up the trail. Well, that's over. Yeah. So, Josh, uh, can we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. Matt, are you, are you listening? Oh my god, don't you remember? Next to the Italian shoe place where I got the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean, she was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. Oh my god, Em, you, maybe you just forgot it. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Well, Do I... you? I guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. <sighs> Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. Then we can get warm. We can get very warm. Okay. Okay, let's go. Well, she's getting chlamydia as well. <laughs> Jerry, Jerry. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. With what? The darkness? <sighs> Exiled. Exiled. <laughs> Works for me. Oh, bar. How far is this cabin anyway? This cabin is the coziest, most romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes upon. <laughs> if we ever make it. I have a feeling luck's on our side. Play your that ass. And maybe you will get lucky. Hey, porn stars. You're gonna need these. Porn star? I pay to see it. Uh, gross. Hey, I'm sorry to kick you out like that. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourselves. Mm-hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. <sighs> oh, I almost forgot. You gotta fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right. Roger that. 
I think Josh was flirting with me. Okay. You want to invite him up with us? Wait, really? What? No. Oh. What a skank. Why, 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 two men? There's two men, no way. She should have like seven. Okay, let's talk to her. Hey, hot lips. Photo booth? All right, read my mind. Okay. Okay, boobs. Yep, there we go. And it's a picture of her boobs. There we go. It's not easy holding the thing all like backwards and forwards at the same time. <laughs> okay, let's go. I've got cabin fever. I, I totally messed it up by accident. I really will try harder to take a better picture next time. <sighs> Burr, it is freezing out here. Now that's something I can help you with. And how are you going to do that? Uh, I'm going to light a fire like the caveman do. Slow down, bitch. Okay, there she is. Emily's as dumb as she looks if she thinks she can cut in on what we got going on. Maybe if we're lucky, she'll try and follow us out here and get eaten by a bear. I think you bring out the worst in her. Is that so? Epic jealousy. Suck it. Okay, let's keep going. Wrong way. Okay. Huh. I guess this thing needs juice or something. Didn't Josh say there was a generator? Yep. Let's go, let's go. Aha, totem. Mike! Generator! Alright, you got it. Danger totem. Okay, we have one of each so far. So, blah, 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 blah. Okay. Danger. Okay, let's go in here. All right. Let's see. Boom. Nice one, Mikey. <laughs> Obviously. And I'm done. Okay, let's keep going. Let's keep going. It makes me wonder, like, they, they climbed over a massive wall to get in. But this tiny, tiny gate, they're like, no, we have to, we have to do it properly. Yeah, totally. No, it's just awesome. Oh, yeah. I bring the hit. Okay. Keep going. Wait, there you go. Wait, the light. I have to fix the light. There it is. There's that booty. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, the camera's too high. The light's too high. Where's that ass? You turned around. Why did you turn around? From Hannah and Beth. I think they'd clean it up. Well, they never closed the investigation. Okay, I'm getting the creeps now. Well, wherever they are, I'm sure they're happy we're all thinking about them. That's a nice way of thinking about it. Yeah. That ass. They did this section on purpose. Oh, 
There's like literally nothing to focus on except her butt. Where is it? There it is. Damn. I don't think we can get up to the cabin with a path block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, aka Wax Museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emma. Ah! Damn it. Jess! Fuck! Hey, Jessica! Yep! Hey! I'm okay! Holy crap, you scared the heck out of me. I didn't think I felt. Uh, you didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. <laughs> uh, yeah. Can you get out? I... Uh, I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. Okay. I'm down. All right, coming after you. Just stay put. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Going. That I ass. lived for like five seconds. Hey. Okay. Oh, Nelly. This place is giving me the willies. And not the good kind of willies. Can I offer you a little comfort and reassurance? <laughs> we'll save it for the cabin, Buster. Hey, okay. another totem. Interesting. Fortune totem. Nice. Oh, yeah, now she's got a totem. Okay, right, let's keep. Let's go back the way we came. Oh, look, stairs. That's useful. I like that they actually put in the effort to make sure that they animated walking up the steps, not like walking up an invisible diagonal ramp like in other games. Okay. Huh. Stogie. We're pissed. Smoke cigars. It's reasonable. Oh. Wonder who's up here. We found a cigarette butt. Whoa. Mystical symbol. This place is like historical. Holy bat cave. It's gotta be Native American, right? I don't think the miners were getting their arts and crafts on now. <laughs> no, no, it's like a shrine or something. A shrine to what? Guys, keep going. You sure you're okay? Take your top off and prove it. Damn it, I walked into nothing. Jesus. Danger, danger, danger. Keep going, let's keep going. That ass. Hers is pretty nice as well. Oh, whatever. Let's hurry up. Oh, 
Mm -hmm. Anything that way? Aha! So there was totem down here. Nice. Cool. The lost totem. Interesting. So did I already miss a totem? Given that's the second one of those. Uh huh. She seems to know exactly where she's going. Uh, cabin. That I ask. Wait, wait for it. There it is. There it is. <laughs> Where do you see the Lincoln bedroom? Oh, are you planning on getting presidential on me? Uh, I'll take a ride on Air Force One. <laughs> all right, all right. Save for the stump speech, buddy. Oh, a telescope. Gonna look at the trees. Gonna look at the clouds. Gonna look at the cabin. Um, whoa. All right. I just saw someone at the cabin. Okay. Uh. Good okay. Hey, Jess. Mm hmm. Stay close by, okay? What's that? So it uh, says this posting Northwestern says Wolf, brown bears up here. a legendary carnivore. This powerful predator oh, is known to attack God. elk. I Horrible and any stricken animal they come across what? in Alberta, the hunting and baiting of wolves is permitted on, on private land. Come You'll be glad on. to know that wolf numbers are kept Let's well under control here in Pines. Grizzly bear. Um, it says omnivore with a strong. Was it predilection towards scavenging? Predilection. I don't know that word. Grizzly is not known to turn down any meal. Its preferred diet is fish, salmon, bass, trout, and teenage girl. And the animal is often found near rivers or mountain streams. So extremely dangerous grizzly bears attack. The attacks on humans are rare. As then the magnificent elk has roamed these lands for thousands of years, though they are often quite docile creatures. The dominant males are known aggressively to defend their harem from any intruders leading to brutal bouts of headbutting and charging. We have now learned something new. Okay. Obviously we need to go down this way given it's the only way the camera's pointing. After you, my lady. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Wait, wait for it. Wait for it. That ass. That ass. I literally, I can never get tired of looking at a nice booty. Okay. I was just flirting. It's just, just answering his mating call. Wow, you're easy. Yeah. Got a lot of love to give. <laughs> <I'm> scared. <laughs> At least he's honest. You know that's a strut, doesn't it, she? Like, it makes you wonder, like, you know how they captured the real people for this game? Like, did they actually capture the way her booty, like, shakes when she walks? Her cabin. <sighs> Damn it, Josh. Couldn't you have at least cleared out the path before sending us up here? <laughs> really? What? 
I didn't figure you for the glass half empty type. You got a better idea? Damn back, Debbie Downer. Well, that was hard. Oh, boo. Show up. Hey, Mike. You got something on your face. Ah. Boo. Okay. Okay. Well, that's how it's gonna be. Yes. <laughs> yes. Oh no, she's in trouble. Whatever are we going to do? I'm so totally going to be panicked about it. With oh. what? A boots oh, on? Do you need any help with that? Hardy are. Come on. All right, Josh. Let's see if you know how to hook up the hot water in your big fancy lodge. I turn on the lights. Okay. So let's explore a bit. Anything here for us to get? Nope. Okay, we've been nosy enough, so let's just get back on with it. Where are we going? We are going in circles. Woohoo! Okay, let's keep going. You can do it. Let's go downstairs. Yeah, totally. Woohoo! Let's go. I like the way she walks. Those things are a joke, man. They don't do shit. No way, bro. I mean, we used to do it all the time, me and... Well... Hey Josh, no hot water's kind of major oversight, don't you think? Yeah. Yeah, you just gotta fire up the boiler. It's in the basement. All right, you guys, see if you can find the spirit board. Chris, let's go find it. It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Um... Okay. I guess so. Brad. You're not gonna regret it. You up for a ride along? Yeah, I don't know about you guys, but for me, because I saw Hayden in um, Heroes when she was like a little girl, she looked like a flipping preteen. It's just, she's always earned for me. She's not hot in my brain. In my brain, she's just like, almost like a little sister, you know? I can never find her that attractive that way. Hey, you notice how I gave Chris and Ash a mission together? Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. Wink, wink, wink. They are very sweet together. I wish they'd just freaking get on with it already. I swear, they just need, like, something to bond over, you know, some sort of traumatic event to send them into each other's arms. I mean, at this rate, they'll be in the geriatric ward before Chris makes a move. <laughs> okay, let's keep going. Let's follow the creepy dude into the basement. No, Sam. That's what you do? Yes, Josh. I just wanted to say... Uh, <sighs> what? It really means a lot to He's me. 26, you're not much older than her. Eh. You came, Sam. Josh, we're here for you. Really, whatever you need, whenever, we're all gonna make it through this. Together. Um, I want us to have a good time, you know? Denied. Hey, watch your step. I'm purposefully giving the answers to like ruin his sex life. It's like cock blocking through uh, game choices. 
Okay. We're just strolling through a basement. That's what we do. Sorry to drag you down into the bow. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. Or some lights. I, mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own, you know. Well, it's definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. Okay. Damn it. Uh-huh. What's that doing here? Is that yours? You bet it's mine. I used to play ball with my dad all the time. Of course, that was before he got too busy to hang out with me. Ah, uh, we'll save it for the couch, right? <laughs> okay, let me see what I can do with this old hot water machine. All right. Here, can you can you hold this? Hold that. Hold is what? Just shine it here so I can see what I'm doing. Don't move. Don't breathe. Hey. Damn it. Can you just keep the light so I can see, okay? I'm gonna put it down. It's not, I'm, I'm not, the controller is on the table, so. Unless the table decides to move. Nice one. Yeah, skills. We learn how gravity works. Okay, first things first. We gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. Mm, sounds kind of complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. Okay. Oh. First time like skills. <laughs> Five, girl. Damn it. Rejected. Joshing because he's called Josh. I totally get it. I was not scared. No, no, you just jumped because you wanted to squeeze in some aerobics. Don't be an a hole, okay? I totally didn't jump. All I said was, What was that? Which is a totally normal reaction to hearing a super creepy noise in a super creepy basement. <laughs> Yeah, so do I, and believe me, so do I. Unlikely. If it were me, I wouldn't want this place to burn down on my watch. Yeah, right. And. <laughs> da -da. Got mugged. 
What? <laughs> nice, nice one. Oh, good. What? But why would you do that? There's all this cool old movie crap down here. What was I? Was I not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you? Are you serious? Are you serial? Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> How dare you? No, like, I, I I you would. know what I mean? Like. Good. Anyway, let's I'm keep ready going. To admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff of humor in it. Joke master. Well, I, I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared, admit it. I was not! Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh! Totally. What in God's name are you wearing? That ass. I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're gonna take a vow of silence. Okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Oy, 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 oy. Here's our one way ticket to the spirit realm. You know what? You know what? No, no. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. Mm. Alright? So have fun. Oh, but watch out for that, Josh. He's a schema. Okay. Okay. Uh huh. Time for more therapy. I would like to understand your feeling toward people who fear failure and worry about what others think of them. Do you share this fear? Oh. I don't share the fear because I wasn't listening. I don't know what he's talking about. How do you feel about Hi, Ryan. How you doing? Hope you're well. I despise them. Um... I see. Well, Emily has quite a fear of failure. Do you feel bad for her? No, I don't. I hate the world. I don't know what he's talking about. So I'm just going to select whatever option I like. From the choices you made. Investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. You're ugly, you've got wrinkles. Oh, sorry, you don't mean you. Oh, sorry, my bad. Others. Which would you say was most important in a person? Loyalty or honesty? I value honesty. So, you would tell the truth. Even if it resulted in an unpleasant outcome for a friend. And what about honesty then? And charity? Honesty. <laughs> charity is overrated, I suppose. Better to be true to yourself than to help others in need, eh? Obviously. Well, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. Yeah. So now the windows are all boarded up and there's a creepy hook. Previously on Until Dawn. So obviously that's the end of episode 2. So once the it recap is the done then it'll end can. the episode. Today is the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy of Hannah and Beth Washington. The twins who are still missing. I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together. And I'm thinking of them. They could learn to switch oh, lights on. Somebody's getting a little friendly. Boom. Butterfly effect. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me with your sluttiness? Stop it! Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, alright. Did you hear that? What in God's name are you wearing? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. Well, watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. That's how it's gonna be. Yes? Yes! <laughs> so, it says here. 
To communicate with the spirit world, you must free your mind of all preconceptions, drop all inhibitions, and generally give yourself over entirely to the will of others, sublimating your every desire to the whims of the spirit master, which is me. It doesn't say that. And all present will remove their garments at my sole discretion. Chris, come on, this is serious. <laughs> oh, I'm deadly serious. <laughs> oh, shush it. Let's try this. Yes, please. Okay, then. Let's see what happens. Ashley, since you're a recent convert, why don't you be our medium for today? Okay, so guys, I think that's a good time to end the episode right there. And we'll carry on um, in the next episode. So anyway, guys, that's it for this episode. Thank you for watching. And as always, goodbye from me and goodbye from Until Dawn. Bye-bye.